A little bit of difficulty up front is the size of the lineman Oklahoma State has. On second down, Orgeron fires, it's picked! And it's going to be a pick six for Oklahoma State. One of the best corners in the country, A.J. Green, runs it back. Three defensive line about They didn't get really pass rush, but he threw out there capitalistly. Corner cuts underneath it. Great play to start this game off for this Okie State defense. That's a name you're going to hear about in the NFL, A.J. Green. Pretty much widely thought of as one of the best in the nation. Great crowd for McNeese's opener last week. A record, as a matter of fact. In trouble here is Orgeron. He's going to have to throw on the run, finds a man, and this is going to be you know, a little bit of a game. Three-yard gain. Ellinger, design run, and he weaves his way out across the 40. Gets a big chunk of that yardage back. It'll be third and about four. A little bit of everything in this offense. And that's Epps coming back. Tried him a couple times in a deep shot. This time they just take the cushion. They fake the jet sweep. Thompson threads that pass, and they say that is complete. To Dalton Schoen, first down. But nonetheless, right on the money, and then Schoen, with a guy draped entirely all over him, is able to make the catch. Receivers, you're going to block, and you're going to play special teams. If you're going to play for me, here's Jet Duffy. He keeps it. Six seasons as their head coach. Here's Jet Duffy. Slam. Complete. That's R.J. Turner. Basher tries to break in and break back out. And Green just grabbed the jersey. Play fake. Duffy got a man running around. Travis Coots. The backup tight end. Here's Thompson again. Give him a yard. The fastest receiver is Fleeks, but Mims is the main target. Oh, oh. The edge. Great job of avoiding. Look at that running capability of this young man. That's a first down into Oklahoma State territory. Akbar Bigamiga was coming off the edge number 11, and as he loops around on that little end stunt, he gets right past him. Nice job of Brewer getting, making him miss. Again, third time they've had the ball in Cowboy territory. Here's Hall. Left side of Crease. Kept his feet going. First down across the 25, 21 more for number 28. Oh, man, I love it. Really upset about their tackling. Remember, they're missing their safety, Greg Eisworth. Another catch for Brees Hall. Nearly got free, but tackled. Shot of the 30-yard line, a gain of four. It's enough, athletic enough to extend plays. There's Petway again. As he is brought down for Brees Hall. The tailback on first down. Purdy will fake it to Hall and run. A.J. Green with the tackle. And Josh Kniffel, co-captain, saying that that should be a face mask. He takes advantage of it. And he pulled his screen to his wide receiver, Stevens Jr. Ball came out, but they're going to mark him down first. Oh, I don't know. No. We got two different calls. Yeah. No, this is Oklahoma State football. It just appeared to signal that he was down. But the ball clearly coming out. A.J. Green with the big hit. And the recovery by Harvell Peel. Got to get him in more of a rhythm and get some confidence throwing the ball down the field. Puka breaks two tackles, make that three. And one more before he takes it to the 44-yard line. Not only the Pac-12 championship game, but an essential playoff game. Depending on what happens elsewhere in the country. And this is a nice play for Bryce Wheaton. Of 20. Nice block by number 87, Michael Loughlin, the tight end. And when you run a lot of wide receiver screens. Speaking of quickly, they're right back on it. In rhythm to the sideline, C.D. Lamb against A.J. Green. Close to a first down. Touchdown to make it a three-score lead for the Sooners. Here comes C.D. Lamb around the edge, trying to use his speed, and then trying to use his strength. He's tucked his shoulder down. A.J. Green chopped him down a gain of one.